Hey beloved, it's Jen. This is going to be a quick update. Um, just wanted to kind of catch you up and capture this moment that I'm in. So last time I spoke to you, I uh, showed you my x-ray and told you how, um, you know, from my layman's eyes that I couldn't see it, that there would be any way to fix it. Um, outside of, of surgery. Um, and, uh, yeah, I, I was right. <laughs> um, uh, I saw the doctor and, um, you know, he, he was really wonderful and really compassionate. And he said, you know, um, you know, usually this is an elective procedure and we talk about your different options that you have and whether or not you want to choose this option or not, he said. But really, I don't see any other option, <laughs> you know. Um, you either choose to replace it or live with it. And, and I don't see how you could possibly live with it. Um, and I was like, yeah, no, live with it is really not an option. <laughs> So, uh, and because of his compassion, he actually um, pushed me through um, so that I was able to um, get the surgery um, in a month's time. So actually right now I am, I think 12 days until surgery. It'll be October 23rd. Um, so uh, I am so grateful and you know, again, God just showing up in this whole process. The the doctor who's going to do my surgery, um, as after I researched, he is actually the best in the area. Um, I'm at the best hospital. He's the best one in the hospital. Um, the uh, and then it turns out he also happens to be friends with um, one of my. Uh, one of my children's schoolmates um and i you know i work at a christian school and his his wife attends bible study with my friend and um so you know god is so so in it um and uh i am i am really ready <laughs> i'm really ready and really at peace and the idea of getting to walk again without a cane, um, you know, is huge. You know, my, I will not, again, short of a miracle, I will not return to, um, you know, the pinnacle of my adult dance career. Um, I also, you know, continuing to age, that continues, you know, that, that, that bar will continue to to um, decline from a physical perspective, but increase from a spiritual perspective. I know that. Um, and, uh, you know, to get to go for a walk with my kids, um, again, take them to the orchard and, and not be um, incapacitated for half a week after, or, um, you know, to, to um, just engage in life again. I'm, I'm really excited for it. Um, you know, my challenge right now is to not wish away the days. And, and that's the part that, um, I've really been, um, asking God for. Um, you know, it would be real easy for me to just wish it was October 23rd already. Um, and I don't want to do that because, um, each day has purpose, right? And, and each day that I'm alive, uh, you know, God has ordained for me before time began, right? To do his good works. And so, you know, my, my prayer, my intention has really been about what is my job? What, why am I here? What good works am I here for today? How do I glorify God today? where I am? How do I live in today and not wish today away just because it hurts? And, um, 
And so uh, I would encourage you uh, all the same thing. Um, it's so easy to wish it were two weeks from now, to wish it were a month from now, to wish it were once COVID is over. Once COVID is over, then I'll have my life back. No, your life is now, your purpose is now. Um, God has good works for you to do now. Um, don't wish away your life. Don't wish away your days. Uh, you know, ask God what your purpose is for today and, um, and live into today. Um, tomorrow isn't promised. <laughs> you know, it is by his grace that he would choose to allow me to live to October 23rd and by his grace that he will sustain me till October 24th <laughs> and by his grace that he will, you know, sustain me to October 24th of 2021 and 31 and 41 by his grace. Um, so, uh, yes, that's my word for today is purpose. Um, purpose in the moment, purpose through the pain. Um, so often we forget it is really not about us. His word says, seek first the kingdom of heaven. You know, what are we doing to seek the kingdom of heaven uh, and his righteousness? And we don't talk enough about kingdom, um, but it is, it is all about kingdom, his reign, his glory, his majesty forever and ever. Amen.